Hello friends, this is Harish Bali from Technofair.com. I use Camtasia to edit videos. Comparing green screen edit of Camtasia with iMovie, I find iMovie to be lot faster and quick. Any video editing software does 90% of the job. For best results, consider working on lighting. Keep the subject at some distance from the green screen. Plus, you may also use blue color as a background instead of green. I am on iMovie. Let me first import the media. I've got a separate folder by the name Green Movie. Here are the video clips and still images. Let me first show you how to put image in the background. For that, drag it to the timeline. And above that image, I will need to put the video clip, which is shot in green screen. Next thing, obviously, I will need to do is drag the image to the complete length of the video. If you want to shorten the video, you can cut the video clip. For ease, I am cutting the video clip. Right click, split and delete this part. Both of these should be of similar length. Let's go to the start. Now to use the green screen effect, simply click once on video overlay settings. By default, it's set to cut away. Choose green slash blue screen. And green screen is gone. Let's play the video. Hello friends, this is Harish Bali. If you look carefully, there are these black lines here at the top which needs to be removed. For that, there is an eraser. Click on it once and just simply use it like an eraser and these marks will go. Play the video. Bali from Technofair.com If I don't need this board at the background, I can do some cane burn effects or cropping. For that, click on the image once and go to crop. Reduce the size by dragging it. Now this is the background. Let's play the video now. Click on video once and it's already set to green blue effect. Hello friends, this is Harish Bali from Technofair.com. Now instead of still image, if you need video in the background, that can also be done easily. Let's delete all that we have on the timeline. If I need this video on the timeline, I'll need to drag it and bring it here. Put the green screen video on top of it. Assuming that both are of similar lengths. Let's split this part. Go back. Same way, select the video. Go to video overlay. Choose green slash blue screen. And effect is gone. Eraser can be applied in the same fashion. We did it earlier also. Hold it wherever you see disturbances or there is a clarity issue screen will become more and more clear. One of the video is shot in the studio and the other video is shot in open park. You may also work on some color adjustments from here. This looks little better. Go back and play this. Hello friends, this is Harish Bali from Technofair.com. I use Camtasia to edit videos. I have a short clip of green screen explosion effect. Let me show that to you through a small act. Now to put explosion in the background, I will need to drag the video. Here it is. And the explosion with the green screen comes on top of it. I will need to do some adjustment on the explosion starting point. Let's say it starts from this point. Go back to the start plate. Click on the clip. Go back to video settings and remove the green screen effect. Go back to the start again and let's play this. When editing in iMovie, I cannot move the explosion clip on the screen, but I can do the same in Camtasia. Look, if I play this continuously now, this is how it appears. I wish if I could do this on iMovie, move this to this corner of the screen. That's it on use of green screen effect on iMovie. Rest everything depends upon creativity. Well, if you have not subscribed to Technofair till now, please do that. I will look forward to hear from you on your comments on use of green screen effect. Thanks for your time.